Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a cup sheet video for you guys. I'm going to be reviewing a couple of their bathing suits. Um, two of them are mine and then the other three are my sister's. Um, one is a one piece and one is a high waisted bikini and then the other three are all bikinis. So I wanted to review my sister's items as well because I wanted to give you guys like a variety of options of different kinds of swimsuits to look at. And I think that the ones that she has are probably a little bit more popular than the ones that I picked. Um, we do have different body types and we wear completely different sizes. So this should um, be very helpful to a lot more viewers. So the first one I'm gonna show you guys is this one and this is mine. It is like an army green colored one piece. It does have a low back and it also has the um, high cut uh, legs, I don't really know how to explain that, but it's like a very cheeky um, one piece and you can see very high up on the thigh and hip area. So like I said, this is what it looks like. And it does have the crisscross design in the front, which I really liked and that's kind of one of the things that appealed to me because I just thought it was cute. So that's what it looks like and this is in a size large. I really like the swimsuit, the material is great. I definitely think it's worth the money and I would say that it is true to size. My only issue with this bathing suit is that because it is a one piece, which this is pretty typical of all other one pieces of any other brand that I've ever tried, the torso is a little short for me. So it like rides up in the back and I have to like tug on it a lot um, to adjust it. And it's been kind of uncomfortable for me. So if you're tall like me, I'm 5'11 and I have a long torso, just know that the one pieces are probably not gonna be very comfortable for you. But that's why I also got the high-waisted bikini, which I'm pretty happy with, um, and I'll show you guys that one next. So here is the top portion of the high-waisted bikini. It looks like this in the front. It's pretty basic, um, except for it has the this little design here, and then this back portion would tie around the back. I hope you guys can kind of see what this looks like. But yeah, so this would tie around the back. And then here are the bottoms. They look like this. They are high-waisted, like I said. And the sides are ribbed. They look like this. And this is a black bikini, just so you guys know. So I really like this one. The only issue I have with this one is that it is in a size large and you cannot get the top and bottoms um, different sizes. So the large bottom is a little bit too small for me. So I wear a different pair of bottoms that I have from a different brand that are an extra large. Um, and that's just because I'm a little bit bigger on bottom than I am top. So if you are pretty much the same top and bottom, it shouldn't be an issue for you. But if you're not, then it could potentially be an issue for you. And um, I think it's pretty common to have, you know, like either a larger bottom, um, smaller top or vice versa. So just keep that in mind when you're looking at these bathing suits. Okay, now onto the ones that my sister got. Um, this is the, these are the bottoms right here. I'll show you kind of like a pretty flower design. This is navy blue. And then here is the top. It's gonna to be kind of hard to show you guys what this is supposed to look like, but basically it ties in the front like, or it crisscrosses in the front and then it would tie in the back. That's what these long string things are for. Um, and it does come with um, some thin cups in here in the bra area. And she really likes these swimsuits. She got these all in a size small and she thinks they fit true to size and they're really comfortable and she thinks they're definitely worth it. So this next one of hers is exactly the same swimsuit except for just in a different design. It looks like this, it's white with like some, um, I don't know what the leaves are called. <laughs> just some green like tropical leaves. Um, and then the top is the same. It has the same uh, crisscross feature in the front and then it does tie in the back so that's what that looks like yet again size small and this is the last one it is slightly different from the others because um, it has the Hawaiian design but on the back it's a little bit scrunched in the seam here on the bottoms and so I believe that these are a little bit more cheeky than the other um, bikinis that I showed you and then the difference in the tops is that this is a halter and then um, it crisscrosses in the front again, just like the other ones, and then ties in the back. But there are no um, cups in this one, so there's no padding at all whatsoever. So that's just something to keep in mind if you are going to purchase one of these. And same thing goes with her size. She's pretty even top and bottom, so these these both fit her really well. But if you had you know a bigger top than you did bottom, it could be an issue for you. So that's just something to keep in mind. But 
Um, we both definitely think that these bikinis and swimsuits are worth it. If you are interested, please stay tuned for the next video and thank you guys for watching. Bye.